Hello there, Michelle Withers here with Creative Success Systems, lovingly known as the Question Queen. All right, we um, are talking about business pages and getting engagement and getting more likes. One of the things that many of you like to use are games and contests. And so I wanted to give you some tips on how to maximize those and make those really work well for you, okay? So I have a list of tips and I hope this will um, take those contests and those fun things you do to the next level. Now, first thing I want to mention is make sure you're staying compliant with your company. Every one of your companies have a totally different rule around contests and giveaways and games and those kind of things. So I'm gonna leave that to your discretion. I know not every um, suggestion I have will work for you and your for all of your companies. So take from this what works best for you. Go ahead and comment below with your company so I have an idea of um, which, which of these you'll be able to use, okay? All righty. So first thing I wanna mention that's super important is every single one of your giveaways should only have one goal. Now, what in the heck do I mean by that? Just one goal. Okay, I will see people um, put this long list of things you have to do to participate. You have to share, you have to comment, you have to like my page, you have to do this, you have to do that. My friends, no. You're asking way too much of people. You need to think of one specific goal. Maybe you're trying to get more followers on your page. Maybe you're trying to get your algorithms up so that your live will get more viewers. Maybe you're trying to get more people into your many chat system. Maybe um, you're just simply, you know, trying to get your algorithms up. One, one thing, okay? Rather it's share it or it is um, like it, it, just one, one thing. Okay, if you make them go different places and come back and comment, it's not going to work. And then whatever the contest is, you always want to direct them to putting something in the comments. We're going to talk about what word you're going to use for that instead of comment in a hot second. So one goal. Don't expect them to do three things. You can do different pieces of that on different days. Um, it will work. You will get such better results if you will only pick one thing. And plus, when you put three things like that, it looks very clickbait-ish. And if you actually wanted to run ads to it, um, it would not work well at all, okay? You need to remember one, 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 one goal per contest, okay? All right, now, I want you to think about the words that you're using in your text. Um, the clickbait words that Facebook doesn't like to see is share, tag, comment, okay? So we need to change it up and get creative. You need to think about your own branding and what you can put on there. So things like type below, share your thoughts below, share is kind of those, um, place your thoughts below, um, give us your ideas below, okay? And then use like the emojis, the like down emojis, either the arrow or the fingers pointing down, but try to avoid those words. If, you know, um, tell us who your friend is in the comments instead of tag them. Um, things like when you want to say share, spread the love. We say, let's start a revolution. Um, have your word. So what's your word that triggers people to share? Okay. That isn't the word share. Come up with something and create a culture so your um, customers know that when you say that, what you mean is to share, okay? Um, so make sure you think about those words, get creative, avoid, and not never use, but avoid, okay? Minimize how much you use, share, comment, and tag. All right, the next thing that we wanna do is talk about some different types of games. Okay, so a couple of fun ones would be things like guesses, whether it's like how many things are in this um, container. Those are always fun. Uh, trivia can be always fun. Uh, the last person to comment, you know, on this post is always fun. Um, also, which of these is your favorite? Um, you know, you have three different things or three different dishes that are made or three different pieces of jewelry or three different colors. Comment your favorite color below. 
um, things like where are they from, their time zone, anything that makes them unique, how many children they have. You could have one every single month. Like, um, for example, with Mother's Day, comment how many children um, that you love on, and that could include your own as a teacher, nieces or nephews. How many you know children do you love on? Your name will go into a drawing um, for a Mother's Day gift. And the cool thing about that is you want the comments to be different words. You don't want them all to comment the same thing. If you want to say, um, or type below, if you want to say type below something to be entered, make it different. Say either type your name or type, type your state or type the month you were born in. You don't want them all to just, you know, type enter or something like that or giveaway. Um, when they all comment the same word, that triggers Facebook too. So you want them to say different words to be entered, okay? Um, another thing that's really fun is to do um, before your lives about anywhere from two hours to one hour, you know, somewhere between 120 and 60 minutes before. Hey, y'all, roll call. If you're going to join the live, comment, you know, put your name down below. And then if you're, when in the first 10 minutes of my live, if you're on, we'll do a drawing, give away a free whatever. Okay. Or one, per, that person will get free shipping or whatever you want to give away. Okay. Do roll calls with a bunch of comments just before your live. Like I said, one to two hours and you will see some awesome things happen with that. Okay. Um, it really like pops up those algorithms. So when you go live, more people are more likely to have Facebook notify them that you're live. It's an, it's fabulous to do. It's really, really works well. Okay. Um, but there's so many fun games that you can play, but you got to be strategic about the games, how often you do them, not more than one a week or, um, you know, one per month. You definitely um, want to have a goal behind it. You want to follow up. Make sure you reply to every comment. Thank you so much for um, entering the contest. Make sure you click reply and thank them for entering. That will help it get seen more, okay? There are all these things that add up and make a big difference. Um, also telling people, hey, hit that heart button below. That makes a big difference um, too um, because Facebook likes hearts more than thumbs up, okay? Think about that strategically, brainstorm. You really can do some fun things. If you've done a fun contest that's um, worked well for you, share it below. We would love to know, help your friends out. What goes around comes around. You share some ideas, you'll get some ideas yourself. All right, my friends, let's build those business pages. Bye y'all.